In 2021, Microsoft released Windows 11, and they introduced various changes to its interface, particularly the right-click context menu. The new design uses fluent design principles and optimizes text layout, which can result in some options being hidden. This has led many users to feel that it resembles a context menu within a context menu, resulting in many users expressing a desire for the classic right-click menu in the earlier versions of Windows. So if you are among those who wish to restore the traditional configuration in Windows 11, then follow along with me as we dive into this tutorial. There are four ways to bring back the classic menu in Windows 11. The first method is to select Show More Options at the bottom of the right-click menu. This action displays the traditional right-click menu that you are more familiar with. While this is a straightforward method, it requires you to do this each time you want to access the old menu, which can feel tedious. The second method involves using the Shift key. Whenever you want to see the classic menu, simply hold down the Shift key on your keyboard and then right-click on an item. This method instantly bypasses the modern menu and opens the legacy right-click menu. It saves you an extra click and is more convenient than the first method. So both of these methods I've shown you so far allow for only temporary access to the classic right-click menu. So if you want to use the classic right-click menu permanently, then follow me and let's use the Windows Registry to bring back that classic right-click menu permanently. First of all, the registry is important for Windows systems. That means any incorrect changes may cause a system failure. Therefore, you must back up the Windows registry before editing it. In case you don't know how to back up your registry, I recommend you to click on this card at the top corner of this video to watch a tutorial I created on that topic before you proceed. So once you've backed up your registry, we can start editing the registry to restore the old context menu. So first you have to open your Windows registry using the run box. So go ahead and press the Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open the run dialog box. Once it opens, type in regedit and click the OK button or press the enter key to open the registry editor. If you are using Windows Home Edition, you will not be able to open the registry editor. Click on the card here to watch the video I created on how to fix the issue of registry editing has been disabled by your administrator. Now let's continue. Once the registry editor opens, expand the H key current user folder in the left pane. Next, open the software folder, then open the subfolder named Classes. From here, locate the subkey folder named CLSID and right-click on it. Select New from the drop-down menu. Then select Key and name it like this. After creating the new key, right-click on it again. Choose New from the drop menu and then select Key. Rename this new key as Inproc Server 32. With Inproc Server 32 selected, simply double-click on the default value in the right pane and click OK without entering any text. To make the registry changes take effect, you need to restart your system. Alternatively, you can simply restart Windows Explorer. To do this, right-click on the taskbar and select Task Manager. In the Processes list, find Windows Explorer, select it, and then click the Restart button at the top. After this, whenever you right-click on the desktop, or anywhere on your computer, the classic menu will appear. Another method to bring back the classic menu is to use the command prompt or PowerShell. For those comfortable with command lines, the command prompt offers another way to switch back to the classic menu. Although Windows Terminal is now the default command line program on Windows 11, you can also use the old command prompt and PowerShell. So go ahead and open the command prompt or PowerShell as administrator. Then copy and paste this command I provided in the video description. 
Once you paste the command in the box, press the Enter key to create a new registry key. Once you see the operation completed successfully, go ahead and type this command line and press the Enter key to end Windows Explorer. Then type this command and press Enter to restart Windows Explorer. This command does the same as the registry edit, but faster and with less clicking around. Now you can use the classic right-click menu permanently. I hope the video helps. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Share the video, and if you have anything to ask, just feel free to drop them in the comment session. See you in the future. Tutorial soon.